Today guys I bring you what in my opinion is the quickest way to progress through the Ariana Val Val Quest stage to get the catalyst and while you're doing this guys you earn great XP too. How's it going guys my name is DPJ and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. If you do enjoy it leaving a like truly helps out and subscribe if you want more Destiny 2 videos. So the Ariana's Val hand cannon sniper rifle dildo has a crazy quest tied to it for its catalyst which will see you playing hundreds of hours to get it completed. You basically have to complete activities using the Ariana's Val to earn progress and it's been determined that even after having both season pass boosts for the catalyst one unlocked at a level 11 and the other at a level 22 it's still pretty slow. Heroic strikes give you 1%, planetary strikes give you 0.5%, gambit matches 1%, gambit prime 2%, vex offensive 1% and standard pvp matches up to 0.5%. So going off of that, Gambit Prime is probably the quickest way to get it done if you're in a team, as games last roughly a little over 10 minutes. Well today guys, thanks to information from my friend Easy Now and I am Cool Guy, I have a method that's even quicker. The weekly rotating PvP playlist at the moment has a game mode called Team Scorched. This mode is not only fun because all that can be used is Scorched Cannons, but matches only last at most 5 minutes. Most of the time not even making 4 minutes due to the 50 kill score limit. But there is either way a 5 limit timer on these matches so 5 minutes is the max it's going to last. And each match gives you 1% towards that Val quest to unlock the catalyst. So you may as well take advantage of this while it's here people, it's a weekly rotator so next Tuesday it will be gone. It's a fun PvP game mode which rewards you towards your EV Val quest, so what's to lose? Just please guys remember to equip the Evianna's Val. It also gives you crazy amount of XP, I mean you get up to 12k for losing a match, never mind winning, and that's literally guys every 5 minutes or less, so it's definitely worth considering people. The issue is with the XP gains is though you wouldn't be able to complete many PvP bounties here because they demand the usage of certain weapons most of the time, or so genin orbs or grenade kills, I mean ones will work with like solar kills and so forth but there ain't going to be many, but it's still decent to earn XP from that's for sure. Now the Ariana's Val Catalyst, the, when you get it completed, after the actual Val Quest stage you have to get then 500 kills with it, but once you get it completed you get 3 extra bullets in the magazine taking it from 6 up to 9 and you also get auto loading holster which reloads the weapon when it's hosted, so it's pretty cool. So yeah guys just a quick video trying to help you guys out so enjoy, but on that note we have come to the end, if you guys enjoyed it leaving a like really helps out, if you're new around here and want to see more Destiny 2 videos be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video I upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that help button. But guys thanks as always for stopping by, hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.